Hey YouTube, it's Mitch at iPhoneCaptain.com. Today we're going to be doing some free tweaks for you. I'm going to try to hit the 50 mark. We'll see how close we can get. The first one I want to share with you is iCleaner Pro. This is probably going to be the most beneficial and helpful tweak that you can get. It's this little blue icon here with a broom on it. And what it will do, it will allow you to troubleshoot that sort of stuff. You can go in here and turn off some tweaks, that thing, and that way you can see if a particular tweak is giving you issues. Uh, we do have a video that goes into more detail, but just hit the little plus button down here and then City of Substrate right here. And as you can see here is the list. Just go down through there and turn on and off whatever you don't want to use and troubleshoot. Awesome little tweak to troubleshoot with. And right here looks like it's probably right. Activator. Uh, this is probably going to be one of the biggest tweaks in Cydia that you will ever learn to use. I suggest go ahead and you learn to use it right now. I use it every day. You can set up hundreds of different gestures just, just for an example. I've got mine set when I hold the status bar to take a screenshot. Watch this. You saw that flash? Trust me guys, there's hundreds of other ways you can do things with activator it has its own little icon hopefully i can find it here right there uh, when you open it up you see you got all these different look from all these different locations you can do things but from anywhere you can set it to do all these things you see here you can turn your music on and off you can turn your volume up and down i actually have my volume set to go up when i try to touch the right side of the status bar down when I want to touch the left side of the status bar. It's very, very handy. That way you don't have to open an, open an app up or do anything like that. You can set things up. Very cool app, guys. Check it out. The next one we're going to talk about, you just saw there was Anim, 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 say Animon or something like that little pink icon right there. This is a theming uh, tweak. And you can download tweaks and or uh, themes and add in here. And I've added one in here called Milkshake. I was watching iTweaks earlier. He had this on his, and I thought it looked pretty cool. Which he had some uh, actual uh, wallpaper that looked better than what I've got. But I don't even have mine turned on. Looks like I need to eat, don't even have it enabled. But if we were to do this, it would re require a respring, and I don't want to have to stop the video for that. But you see what you can turn it on and off here. You can turn things on and off, all different sorts of uh, icons, badges. Uh, uh, you can make your control center even be themed. The one I like the most about all this is you can theme your settings right down here, your settings icons. I, I really like how it adds that extra little punch and makes it look really nice. That's called Milkshake. Check it out. It's part of the Animon, and I think you'll really enjoy it. Another one I want you to check out is called No Power Alert. That gets rid of all that battery business whenever you get down to 20%. It, it automatically kicks that off. You don't have to worry about that. Another one is called OTA Killer. You be, be sure you can check it out. That, that way you don't accidentally download something. But if you download iCleaner Pro, you don't have to worry about that because you can come in iCleaner Pro and actually enable that from in here you don't even have to download an extra tweak see this this uh actually allows you to turn that on and off right here so you got ota software updates right there all you need to do is flip that on and you don't have to worry about that anymore okay the next one we're going to talk about here is no folder backgrounds and it's just a little something extra to add, you know, it's not nothing necessary, but if you see here's a folder and it's gotten rid of my background, it just sort of blends in with everything else here on the, that you see when you open it up. Very cool little tweak and definitely one I recommend checking out. You've been noticing my icon spinning and you've been sitting there chomping at the bits. What is that? What is that? What is that? If you're new, you probably don't know if you've been in the jailbreak community in very long at all you know that's cylinder and cylinder allows you to choose i think it's maybe like six or seven different gestures at one time that you can have enabled and you can even set it to randomize those if you wish uh and all that's customizable from under the settings part here go down here to cylinder and in here you go to the effects section and in here you can choose, I think it's like six or eight different things, but you see there's hundreds of different 
actually there will be thousands of combinations if you, you were to figure it all up mathematically uh, and, and would even uh, you know it would be astronomical but anyway another one guys and I probably should have started off with this one is one that you definitely need to get is called rocket bootstrap but before we go on to this for right while we're looking at this uh, screenshot here CC recorder for iOS 10 this is a free one guys and it allows you to record your screen uh, Ryan Patrick I don't think has updated display recorder yet which is sort of the OG uh, display recorder for the iPhone or iOS but now uh, CC recorder is sort of rooting in on his territory and this one here actually puts a little icon in your control center right down here on top which I don't actually have it working properly right now I have installed it but I couldn't really get things working out just exactly right but that doesn't mean it's not a bad tweak it's because I've got so many on my device trying to make this video for you guys and I do not recommend doing this at all because I've spent most of my day trying to figure out and troubleshoot and it's definitely not worth it uh, I'm just doing it like I said for the sole purpose of the video and another thing you see here that's missing is my labels and a way you can do this is by downloading Hide Labels 10 but you can also do this with Animon you probably saw while we were in there there was an option that you could choose and you could disable icons and I think it was actually up here in the main section uh, no icon labels right here and I think I have that checked so see how things sort of start stepping over one another and it causes a little bit of conflict and then that's when you get all these Apple loops and you have to start looking for videos from guys like me to try to figure out just what the fuck's going on and how, what have you done. Another cool one is called Wormhole guys and this one here uh, it adds uh, a little bit of extra punch too. What it does is it'll let you respring whenever you want to and it adds it under your control center right here. It'll add right there under the do not disturb. You just sort of long press on that and it'll pop up right there but I don't actually have it installed but that doesn't mean like I said that it's not worth getting. Very, very cool tweak and definitely one you, de you want to check. Another cool one you're going to like is called Speedy. Now, Speedy removes animations from your device. It's sort of like, uh, there's the, I can't think of the other one. Now, I've got so many tweaks in my mind, but we had one off from the last two or three jailbreaks. It was sort of the, the OG, if you want to call it that, a tweak for this uh, speed customizer. What was it called? I'll think of it the very second this video, this camera is shut off. I know it will. But anyway, you want to go in here and type in speedy and check it out s p e d y speedy right up here at the top yeah, like i said it is free this is the first version guys this is going to be a killer tweak because i know this guy's probably going to add a lot of the good stuff what it does is it removes the animation from when you're opening apps and things like that it don't have all that little fancy popping in and out and all that stuff it takes all that away and it makes your device appear to be running so much faster and actually it does probably make it faster. Very cool tweak. Grab it. I know you'll enjoy it. Alright guys, the next one we're going to talk about is called Hot Dog. Now this is a lock screen tweak too and it lets you customize a lot of things on your lock screen. Uh, another cool lock screen tweak is one called... Uh, shoot. I don't want to get all these mixed up, so we'll just sort of take them as they come. But anyway, camera shy, what that does is it removes that little icon down at the bottom right side. If that sort of gets on your nerves, you can install camera shy and get rid of it. Uh, dark messages, this uh, does exactly what you would think. It turns your messages dark. Let me show you what that looks like with dark messages installed. I'm going to open up my messages app. I prefer it full time. I'll, I use this always on mine, and uh, it's called Dark Messages. Uh, the other tweak I was trying to find there, and I couldn't get my hands on, was is, is actually called uh, Modem LS or whatever. 
Uh, but anyway, we'll get we'll, we'll get to it here just in a second. Uh, the next one is called Time Until Alarm. Now what this does it, it is when you set your alarms, it tells you how long you have until they go off beside of your alarm when you open up your uh, alarm in your setting, uh, clock settings out. So that's a pretty cool little deal. The next one is called No Page Dot Seven. Uh, all these guys have been have been updated. Uh, that, that removes the page dots on your screen. Flip Control Center. Uh, another cool little tweak. What it does is in your flip, if you pull up your Control Center up here at the top, it, it lets you customize the the actual settings you have right there. You can you can make them be in whatever order or whatever you want them to be. There's so much to choose from. I have that in a video on here. Icon Renamer, uh, that's another cool one. And it allows you to rename the icons on your on your springboard to whatever you would want them to be. Uh, personally, I, I a lot of times I keep my labels hidden. Uh, swipe for more. Now this is a really cool tweak because what it does is inside of Cydia, rather than have you uh, pull up all these different things uh, and, and tap and then hit install or, and modify or whatever you actually swipe to the left and it puts a little a little option here over on the right side to put it in queue and then that way you can download like six or eight different things at a time without uh, having any problems but I tried to install some of these today guys and where there's so many of them uh, I figured it would be better just to list them out and just sort of describe them to you rather than try to put them all in and in, in cram them in one video because you're not going to be able to, to take the time to look anyway. This is basically just uh, to get you aware of them. It's not really a review of the tweak. Uh, another cool one that I think that you'll really get a lot of uh, use from is one that I, that I really enjoy. And, and, and if you don't have a device that has 3D Touch, Peekaboo will actually add uh, the 3D Touch. Uh, some of the options actually will, will right to your screen. But you know, there is it, what what we need here now, developers. You listen to me. We need a way to turn to disable these uh, this jiggle mode, be able to turn it off uh, because that I've noticed that's been an, a, an issue. The cool tweak here. It's called Preference, uh, Preference 2, I think, maybe Preference Pain. Let's see what it's called here. I'm getting all jumbled up here, seems like. Uh, this video is, is going to shit. Preference Organizer 2. This is it right here. It actually lets you organize your tweaks and things in different settings. You see, I have my regular applications over here in a different location that I do my tweaks. All my tweaks are in a different a section which makes it much much better to uh, to get a to get to use them and here's peekaboo and I have the sensitivity turned way up there's there was something I refer to peak and something they refer to as pop the peak is the amount your finger touches the screen needed to to peek into something the pop is the amount your finger touching the screen needed to pop into something which to me that sort of sounds like the same thing but uh, apparently it ain't and if you have any problems it says to turn on that messages all you do it and trust me guys this was working really really good earlier uh, I've actually probably installed something that's con got a conflict or something with it peekaboo but trust me it's very very nice if you don't have 3d touch on your device trust me you want it another one uh, and, and this may be the culprit right here because earlier today I had some issues when I pulled this one up. Uh, tap, tick, tap, tap, tick keys. Uh, this is a, it adds this, this tap to your screen, to your keyboard, but uh, it's sort of giving me some, some problems, you know, so you might want to be sort of leery about checking it out, but anyway, it's, it's, a, it's a pretty nice little tweak when you can get it functioning properly. Uh, Alright guys, the uh, <clears throat> name of the one I couldn't think of was Tap Tick Keys. Tap Tick Keys. This is it here on the screen you see right here. 
it puts that little vibration and that little ticking sound when you touch the keys like a lot on a lot of the Android phones that's out now. Very good, very nice little tweak, very uh, worth checking out. Uh, and also one that we was looking at earlier that I really didn't do a very good job explaining is called Modem LS. Uh, I'm not even sure that's how you pronounce it, but anyway, it has this really cool looking little battery up here and it shows the battery level you have and you can also scoot your date and do a, do a few other little things. And on Camera Shy guys, I spoke a little earlier in the video, but it actually it removes the little icon down here in the bottom right corner on your lock screen. And it's very simple, you know, it's not very much to it, but I wanted to touch back on that to make sure that you did know what that one was about, okay? Uh, another cool one is called Status Fall X. Uh, and like I said, we've got detailed videos on a lot of these, but if you get your phone and open it to the screen, and if you hold the volume key down, you'll see in the status bar up there, the little round bars, that's your volume. Just a little bit better volume hub than, than Apple offers. Definitely, definitely one you see on my screen a lot. Another cool volume hub though is one called Sonus. This requires an additional repo, but it'll be in the description for you. Um, what this one does actually is it puts a full line up there and it the, the line comes all the way across the screen when it's full and goes back down as you go back to lower your volume. But personally, I prefer the other one, but that's all in your taste. Uh, another cool one is Fingal. Uh, you probably saw my screen. This is a theming tweak. And you see how my icons are animated. That's coming through Fingal. When you download it, you only get one theme, but it's pretty cool. But you can get other free ones as well. Go in here to your tweaks. Remember, we got them in a different location now. Go to Fingal. And right here, you see I have this one called Basic Example. Uh, you download other themes, and you just they'll, they will appear under the disabled part. You just drag them and drop them up there and respring, and it will update your theme. Very, very cool little, little, little tweak, guys. I'm I apologize about my dog. She's she's not been doing very well. She's sick, seems like. But guys, there are several tweaks. I think you definitely should check out. Uh, I'll try to add more to it as we go along. Uh, hopefully, you enjoyed the video. But if you aren't a subscriber, guys, please hit that subscribe button, share this video, and keep coming back.